regarding is a very big threat of rising and I need you to send someone to take them out yes who is it my queen the straw hats they gain way way too close with comfort I want them eradicated pronto yes my queen my granddaughter can get the job done. Meet Urza Scarlet. As Urza kneels. Yes. I see. She has tremendous hockey. She's suited for the job. And she has one of the great supreme blades. Sorcery. Perfect. Now, I'm going to eliminate our enemies. There. Yes, my queen. I'll get on it right away. As Urza glitches out the main castle with insane speed. As we cut back to the Straw Hats. Yo. Like I said, these fruits are pretty insane. I happened to come across a book that has a psychopedia of them. And this one, as uh, everyone on the crew is like, oh. As I look at Usopp, hey man, catch. As I throw the Del Fruit to him. He's like, ain't no way I'm eating this Del Fruit. Trust me, it'd be worth your wild. It's called the Ricochet Ricochet Devil Fruit. Self-explanatory what it does, right? Wait, Ricochet? So you gear for like if I throw it against something just bounces off? Yeah. <clears throat> but they said the user can also infuse it with items as well. So if you're get if you see what I'm getting at, Usopp. Wait a minute. You're telling me with my guns, I can curve my bullets in mid-air if I want to? Precisely. Not only things, you have to get to that point when you use the Del Fruit. Are you willing to stand up for it and challenge, take the challenge? I mean, not really giving me much of a choice right now. It's like either take the fruit or you're going to sell it, right? As Nami's like, yep, you already know. Uh, all might as well give it a try. But you sure is good to have so many Devil Fruit users on our crew? What if someone, I don't know, blows our ship up? As Usopp literally spoke that into existence. What the hell was that? As the front of the Sunny, where the big line is, kind of gets cut in half viciously as we all run out the ship as we see one person standing immense the carnage as she gets down in a position like spider-man where she's talking down to us so this is the my pirate hunter no no zoro straw hat please Storm Tempest, Nami, the Devil Child, Miko Robin, Usopp, the Sniper, and the Medic Chopper. Oh my gosh, he's gorgeous, says one voice. Sanji, this is not the time for that, says Nami. As she pans over. And you, you must be Crisis, my main objective other than Nico Robin. Oh, I'm your main objective? Why is that? As my eyes turn into the Sharingan. Yeah, I heard the reports about you. You have a very 
interesting devil fruit. In fact, it can turn the world into calamity in the wrong hands. And we don't need that, says Urza. As she begins to pull her blade out. As Zoro is like, guys, let me fight her. She has something that I want. She has a supreme grade blade. I could add that to my collection. As I kind of look at Zoro, you think you can fight her? Man, who are you talking to? I'm becoming the I'm gonna be the world's greatest swordsman. Why not test my strength against her? I don't know. I feel some type of deception about her. Don't worry about it. I can look after myself. Alright, Zoro. Well, you heard the man. What's your name again? The name's Urza. Alright. My buddy here wants to fight you. And no one interferes, understand? As Nami puts her hands up, first of all, she's on our territory. Therefore, we can jump her if need be. Hey, shh. Honestly, to tell you the truth, she could probably get past my uh, guard. As Nami turns cold. <laughs> um, pretend I didn't uh, say that, please. Uh, I'm not worried about you. Anyway, Zoro, we're going to fight here or not. Nah, you see that island over there? Let's fight there. As Zoro and Urza jump towards the island, crashing down onto it. This should be a spectacle. I can't wait to see how far you got, Zoro. Show me. I say in my head. As everyone else is watching as well. As Robin is like petrol's who she is. She's part of the, the no. It's Robin, I'm like, what's up? She's she's part of the royal guard. Um, am I supposed to be scared? Yes, you're supposed to be scared. Damn it, the royal guard is above the Gorse. Hmm. As I snap my neck to her, you said what? As Zoro and Urza begin to clash and fight. Not bad, pirate hunter. You're not quite bad yourself. As Zoro pushes her away. I see. You are, are really good. But you could be better. Zoro's like, what you mean I could be better? Uh, so right now, I'm only using 10% of my strength. You're bluffing. Ain't no way. You can't get into my head. Alright. You know, you think I'm bluffing, huh? Oh, uh, you're in for it. I could have killed you several times right now. Says Urza. As I jump on the gate that's around the ship. So I stand on it. As I'm reading her hockey level. Oh. So you can see it too. You have the odds of a supreme king as well. And your friend Luffy. Y'all two picked up on it. This could get dangerous Luffy. Yeah. But. Don't interfere with Zoro's fight. Huh? What you mean captain? Let Zoro prove himself. Don't you lose, my my friend. Didn't you promise me you would never lose again? <laughs> yeah, I did, Captain. As Zoro gets his footing. You ready for round two? As he puts on his, his do-rag. Oh, so you think putting that on is going to change the outcome? As Urza makes a sly face. You're in for it. My captain 
and my friends are watching. That's all I need to get through you and take that sword as mine. <laughs> you keep saying you're going to take my sword. You're not even worthy of Switch Lee's power. Not at all. In fact, you have the legendary Ryuma's blade. How did you get that? They rob him? No, I fought him in battle. He's dead. How did you fight him in battle? He's been gone for hundreds of years. Huh, would you say? As Urza gets a tick mark, and she really, like, speed blitzes the fuck out of Zoro. Zoro dodged it similar to how Ichigo was fighting Orkyo's second form. Barely dodged the attack. As he's like, holy shit. She wasn't lying then. As he barely stops her onslaught. But he does get like slashed up and shit. It's like looking really, really bad. As I'm like, ah, Captain... I think I have to get involved with this one. Yeah. We have to train the rest of the crew to our extent. Yeah. As Urza is about to go for the kill shot. As I blitz Susano. As I block her attack. Don't let your story end too quickly. I see great potential in you, Zoro. Let me take care of this. You're my best friend. I'm not going to sit here and watch you get killed over something that they want from me. At the end of the day, it's still my business to confront this threat. She came here looking for me and Nico Robin. And you mess with my Nico Robin while well, you mess with me as well. So, prepare yourself, Urza. I really don't think you know what you're getting yourself into. <laughs> if I did, you think I would come on this mission? I know I could take you down. And like I said, I only was using 20% of my power. I'm nowhere near full strength. You talk a lot. Show me. So everyone's like, oh, who? Yeah, tell her that's right, babe. Put her in her place. As I wave to Nami and uh, Boa. Yeah. I will. Renegon. Mighty. Push. As I push Urza back with tremendous force. Send her flying throughout the forest. As I will put my hands in my pocket as I walk her down. Don't tell me that's the best you got. He hasn't seen anything yet. As Urza cuts her hand on her blade. As her blade turns into crimson red with rune marks on it. Runes. That's dangerous. I have no idea what blade is. So the archer says Zoro. Curses. Don't let that blade touch you. Huh? It's too late for that. Double cleaver slash. As Urza slashes my chest, sending blood everywhere. Oh my god! Yells Rami, Boa, and Nami. Huh. Good riddance. Now the rest of you. Get ready. Defend yourselves, but to be honest, there's no hope for you. <coughs> what is is doing to my body? How are you still standing? What did you do? Well, since you're gonna die anyway. I cursed you with a flesh-eating disease. In fact, you're the only person that survived. What are you made of? But if 
that's the case, why aren't you affected by it? <laughs> Would you like to know? Well, whoever masters essentially, essentially gets immune to property from it. So, the only way you're healing from that is I say necessary. But, you're right, that needs to be eliminated, so bad luck on you. As she rubs my head. As she's about to, like, move her head from my, her hand from my head. <laughs> What's so funny? Well, lucky for me, I might be the exception to that, huh? What? As I grab her hand, and then I put my hand on her face, and I begin to drag her through the mud, as I drag and throw her straight into a mountain. Huh. It took a little minute to figure out how that rune works. Ah, it's just a bad matchup for you, Urza Scarlet. As Urza is freaking wounded like crazy, I literally slammed her straight through a mountain. As she comes out on the other side, scratched up and bloody. What? How? He only threw me through that mountain and I took so much damage. He's, he's a monster. You're not the first person to say that. <laughs> right, babe? As they turn red. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, enough about me. Who sends you to me? As I blitz over to her, as I stomp on her leg. Crushing it, essentially. Now she's immobile. Now, I don't... <coughs> oh, that hurts! <sighs> she says. Now, if you don't want your other leg broken... In her head, she's like... How is I getting dominated so badly by him? It makes no fucking sense! You should be dead! She yells out. Like I said, I'm just a bad matchup for you. Even if you are using a devil fruit, my hockey should nullify it. <laughs> Did you forget how things work, silly? As long as I have equivalent hockey to your hockey, sweetheart, my devil fruit is not getting nullified. Whoever sent you here, sends you here to fail. Now, like I said, tell me who sent you. As I activate my Renegon and summon the path that rips out the tongue if you lie. Tell me. And this just does more than rip your tongue out. It's going to rip your soul. So you don't even go to Nirvana. Or hell. You just be wiped from existence. As everyone is like, whoa, that's fucking OP. You just always pull out a random power out your ass, says Sanji. <coughs> it, it seems that way, but it's way more complicated than that. As I my eyes off her, as she does a flip, a front flip, and like kick dead in my face. Sending me careening back. As she pulls out a stroll. Then think how I have to use this, but this is the only way I'm getting out of here. As if a verse summons her back to Marine's wall. Huh. So, Robin, he wasn't lying about the girl I say. Isn't that one of their marks as she walks over? Yeah. Interesting. Very, very interesting. <sighs> as Urza stabs her blade into the ground to use it as something to keep her balanced because her leg is literally broken. That monster. I have to tell Gramps about him as she passes out.
And yeah, I'm going to leave it like that, guys. Like, comment, and subscribe. And share the video. Part 10 will be out probably tonight. If you get this video to 10. That's all I ask. Peace, y'all.